Canadian and Chicago area native Bob Newhart turning 91 today from his stand up comedy to his television shows. He's made many of us laugh over the decades. Yeah, Dean Richard sat down with Bob Newhart on Zoom to talk about his life and career. Hello. For the past 50 years, Bob Newhart has been a fixture in America with his successful TV sitcoms, with movie roles, and award-winning appearances on other new shows. The low-key comedian originally from Oak Park, Illinois, who almost became an accountant, turns 91 years old this weekend and is as funny and as sharp as ever as I found out on a birthday Zoom call to my longtime friend who's been quarantining at home during the pandemic. You know, it's like... It's like Groundhog Day, you know, I didn't, I, I, I saw the movie and I enjoyed it, but I didn't know we'd be living it some years later. Have you pretty much been just sticking to the house, uh, you know? Stuck in the house, yeah. Yeah. Well, what do you do to occupy your time? Well, I'm, I'm great at, uh, at projects. I, I'm, uh, I, I never quite finish them. <laughs> <laughs> They're always kind of half done, yeah. but, but I'm great at that. I, I am probably the best in the world at, uh, at the end of the day, I've accomplished absolutely nothing and I'm exhausted. And he's more than earned that time to do nothing. He spent his life making us laugh with his stand-up comedy, his shows, and groundbreaking comedy albums. But who makes Bob laugh? Well, I'll tell you who. I think, aside from my friend Brickles, I think Pryor is the most influential comedian for the past 50 years. He, he just, he's incredible. Now turning 91 years old, Bob was reflective about his personal and professional longevity. My wife and I, Jenny and I, uh, this, this coming January, we'll, we'll be married 58 years. And, and people will ask me, what, what do you what do you account for the longevity of a marriage and uh, and I really think laughter I really think laughter is 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 a very important part of life especially now with the pan pandemic uh, it's your friends and it's family and and that's what the world's all about it isn't about awards and that kind of thing it's about your friends I miss so many of my friends that aren't here anymore, Dick Martin. Uh, I mentioned Don Rickles. Rickles and I had a, had a deal. Uh, if I was in the audience and he was on stage and he wasn't making any sense, I was going to come out of the audience. And I wasn't making any sense. Uh, he, he would come out of the audience and say, you know, it, Bob, it's over, okay? You know? <laughs> and uh, there were a couple of times with Rickles. I, I started toward the stage several times. <laughs> But then I turn around and take my seat again. Happy birthday, Bob. Dean Richards, <laughs> WGN News. Thank you.